with these fatal lines. Mad flow, I give it to ya. Prickly pear, is it to ya? Mad prickly, we give it to ya. Worldwide, we give it to ya. Roar like your girl, put naked on the floor. She's foaming, she's choking, I get crazy jaw. Wanna flick chick, she begs for more. I tell that donkey, turn out that whore. Carpet burns from the rug on the floor. Catalina Tana, man, I'd love to do a war. Half man, I force, man, I pump. My music, <laughs> the best. No, no, no. Um, I'd like to say um, thought-provoking. Um, I like to have a bit of like double meanings in there. I like to use a lot of like similes, punchlines, metaphors, or whatever. Um, I use a bit of like fantasy um, because I'm into my comics and stuff like that. So, you know, meta metaphysical stuff. I drop a bit of like reality in there. I try to be a rounded MC. The MC, I mean, the acronym is Master of Ceremony. So, you know, the, the MC is the crowd mover, the, the person that's supposed to entertain. I'm from a town or place called Handsworth, which is quite a uh, you know, it's quite a, you know, some people say it's a gritty part of town, but I think because of the hustle hustle and bustle, you know, being uh, from Handsworth and having to always prove yourself, I think that kind of gave my style the kind of like raw street edge that it's got. And for me, you know, even though I had friends and I knew a lot of people that, you know, they were doing the street stuff and all that, I was so engulfed in the music and the vibe and the way that it made me feel I was I was more interested in like learning the latest dance move or dance craze than actually being part of like the streets and uh, people sometimes stereotype an area or a city and they just you know they you know they see it for the bad things. There's a lot of like good things, a lot of good people, and, and positive things that have come from Handsworth. You know what I mean? And um, I hope to I hope to look at it. You know, or I hope that I'm looked upon as one of the people that brings some of that positivity through my music. I'm bringing you to Hensworth Park because this is a place where, um, when I was a kid, I used to go to um, the sound systems used to play here. So sound systems, they used to set up big speakers and play loud music, and they used to have loads of like festivals and carnivals and all that here. Right? It's, it's really cool to, you know. Um, it's always good to kind of look back and see where you're coming from and like you know I always believe that you've got to go back to go forwards you know this is probably one of the first places that I actually well not not uh, well it is the first place that I got to see big sound systems and people performing so it was here so, so yeah this park this park holds a, holds a lot of lineage so it's kind of cool and I'm kind of glad that I kind of went from the transition of being one of the kids watching to be one of the performers on there. As a kid, <laughs> as a kid, um, you know, uh, when it, I remember, I remember, you know, one of the silliest things I do, I did as a kid. You know, the the ice froze, and we we went over to that little island, as we called it, which was one of the most silliest things that. I've done. So, you know, kids don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Even when I, when I, uh, when I went to, went to live in America, and uh, they'd ask me about stories, I'd be telling them about, okay, well, you did things out in the park, such and such. Well, we used to do a similar type of thing, you know, in Birmingham, in in Handsworth, you know, what I'm saying, and had a sound system to the thing. So, so yeah, it's got a lot of lineage, got a lot, you know, a lot of history, you know. I haven't actually had a walk around this park like this for like years, so. You know, so it's good, it's good. Brought back a lot of memories. <laughs>